Hello and welcome to this new video tutorial of Magento 2 product bundle discount. Now this particular plugin allows the Magento 2 web store admin to add products in a bundle and apply discount to it. The discounted bundle products are visible to the customers under the bundle product link on the storefront and within the shopping cart as well depending upon the configuration that has been set by the admin. Uh, the admin also has the option to set the product types for the base product and the child products in the bundle as simple or configurable and can set the discounts to be of the fixed and percentage type. Kindly note that if we edit the bundle product quantity at the cart page, discount amount may remove. To avail a discount, you need to add bundle product as it is to the cart there. Apart from that, the customers can select the configuration of the configurable products at the time of purchase within a particular product bundle there having a particular discount on the same. So in today's video tutorial, I'll be taking you through the workflow at the storefront at the customer's end and then I'll be showing you how to set up the product bundle discount and the initial configuration settings for the particular plugin itself. But before I proceed further with this particular video tutorial there, Please do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates from my end. And if you find this particular video helpful, then do kindly give it a thumbs up. So here you can see that as a customer, I can see uh, the bundle products link in the header here, as you can see. So if I tap on the bundle products here, I'll be able to see one particular section that's the extra special bundle price. So here we can see the bundled uh, items are there and basically the pagination also works here right now i've set uh, two bundle products to be shown on uh, one page and i've only only created two uh, bundle products uh, one is having simple products and one is having simple and configurable as you can see here on the second one so that's why we don't have any pagination i'll show you that how the pagination works in a while from now uh, but before that you can see that we have the extra special bundle price and section and here we are having uh, the uh, bundled uh, products uh, as provided by the admin here. Here we have the base product uh, and the child products as well. Now in the configuration what you can do is you can uh, disable the disable to show the uh, base product and only the child products of the bundle would be displayed to the customers uh, here under this extra special bundle price by tapping here on the bundle products uh, link that we have now here you can see that uh, within this particular bundle uh, one we have uh, a saving of 12 dollars the actual price was 360 now it is for 348 dollars and the customers can tap here on the add to cart bundle price and uh, the particular bundle products would be added into the cart on the uh, particular price that is 348 dollars uh, with the 12 dollars savings there itself now uh, here you can see that uh, we have the quantity that has already been preset for each of the uh, products in the bundle for the child products as well as for the base product there here we have the base product as landscape and uh, we have the uh, child products as t-shirt 2 and the landscape here uh, in this particular one here you can see that i've used uh, the base product as watch and the child products as DD sport watch t-shirt and the configurable t-shirt now uh, as i've already told you we can make use of the simple and the configurable products to uh, create the uh, what we say as the bundle products there and here for this particular bundle as you can see here it was earlier for 1172 dollars but now it's for 1050 dollars and we are going to save 122 dollars if we are purchasing this bundle uh, right now so here we have an option to configure uh, the bundle as well because we have a configurable product within the bundle so if I tap here on the configure I'll be able to choose the color and then we'll be able to add the particular uh, bundle into the card to make a checkout thereafter uh, to show you how this particular bundle appears in the card there for that what I'll do is I'll just add uh, the uh, particular bundle into the card there so let me tap here on the add to card bundle price so we are saving $12 initially it was for $360 now it's for $348 so here you can see that we are having the bundle discount of $12 applicable on the particular bundle product uh, that's for t-shirt landscape so here you can see that uh, only landscape has now been shown as 20 quantity because the base product was landscape and the uh, 
child product was also landscape so that's why it's showing 20 quantity here for the same and for the t-shirt it's showing 10 quantity there now uh, thereafter the customer can tap here on the proceed to checkout button to make a checkout thereafter so this was about one uh, bundle product there now let's check the other one so let me uh, clear the cart first so I'll just remove the particular products from the cart so as a customer I want to now here you can also see that uh, the particular product bundle discount products are visible in the shopping cart as well the shopping cart is empty and here as well you can find the extra special bundle price now this setting uh, is available in the admin backend configuration of the plugin itself wherein you will be able to enable or disable the extra special bundle price section within the cart as well so this would also be visible as an extra promotion section in the cart there if you want you can enable this up for the shopping cart as well so as i've already told you the discounted bundle products are visible to the customers under the bundle products here in the header by tapping here on the bundle products in the header or within the cart as well all right now let's check this other one that's having a configurable product for this bundle so we'll be saving 122 dollars so let's configure the product let me choose a particular color let's tap here on the add to cart bundle price and you can see that the uh, particular ones have been added into the cart so the color gray has been added for the configurable t-shirt with one quantity and here you can see that the bundle discount is applicable and we are getting a off of uh, $122 on the complete price there so the actual subtotal was $17.72 and uh, now we are going to pay uh, the amount uh, that has uh, the deduction of $122 there so this was the workflow at the customers end now if I show you with view and edit cart there as well we'll be able to find uh, the discounted bundle products uh, here so if I scroll here you can see the extra special bundle price is visible here as well and here we have the options to add the simple products or the configurable ones uh, within the bundle product as well to the card there to get a particular discount so here we got $122 as a discount for this one we got $12 discount on the actual price of the bundle products there all right so this was the customers and now let's uh, hop on to the admin backend panel let's see how the admin would be able to set up the uh, product bundle discount so for that let's tap here on the sign in button so what we'll be doing is we'll be checking out the base product that's the watch and we'll see how we can do it i've already added the uh, product bundle discount to the same so for that what you need to do is now uh, can you note that after the successful installation of this particular plugin you will find the product bundle list and under that you will be having the bundle group listing now here all of the bundle groups that you have created would be visible here under this particular section to you so if i open this up here you can find the bundle name enable from and enable to values the discount type discounted price 122 and 12 dollars the base product as watch and landscape the creation date and from here you can view the products within the same by opening the particular link in another window itself so here if i open you can see the bundle child products as configurable t-shirt dd sport watch and t-shirt uh, for the particular one that's the what now how uh, to set up the product bundle discount on the products for that what you need to do is you need to go to catalog and products and you can edit any of the products there uh, that you've created so we are going to use a base product within which we'll be adding the child products so for now if i give you an example for the watch let me edit the watch so on the product edit page for the watch that's the uh, simple product so we can use a simple product as well as a configurable product to create a uh, product bundle discount uh, se uh, section there so here we have a watch and it's a simple product now if i scroll down here you'll find one option that's the bundle product discount now here tap on the bundle product discount and here we have the bundle product discount button tap on that right now you can see that i already added the uh, details here for the bundle uh, name the uh, base product quantity uh, enable from enable two values the discount type as fixed or percentage the discounted price as 122 dollars and i've added the products as well 
so uh, if you want to uh, basically uh, add these things what you need to do is uh, you need to tap here on the add new bundle and that would bring up this particular section wherein you have to give the bundle name the base product quantity uh, the enable from and enable to values the discount type as whether it's a fixed one or a percentage one the discounted price you can also ignore the base product from the discount as well and then you can tap here on the add product and that will bring up the complete listing of the products there and then you can select any of the products that you want to add and uh, here you have to enter the quantity uh, that you want to set for the uh, same and then tap on the add selected products to add the particular selected products to the uh, bundle there all right so that's very easy so you just need to tap here on the bundle product discount tap on the add new bundle this will bring up this particular section uh, fill up the details here for the bundle name enable from discount type and the rest of the values then select the products with quantity and after that you have to add to the selected ones and then tap on the uh, done button and after tapping on the done button you have to tap here on the save button and then what will happen is that that particular bundle would then be visible here under the particular section that's the bundle uh, products uh, link and under that you can see that we have the watch dd sport t-shirt and the configurable t-shirt as well so let me give you an uh, example once again so here you can see uh, the configurable t-shirt was selected uh, let me uncheck this particular thing here so here we have dd sports watch t-shirt configurable t-shirt and then we need to tap here on the done button and then on the save button thereafter all right so that was how to set up the product bundle discount uh, in the uh, admin backend under the catalog section now let me take you to the initial configuration settings for this particular plugin for that you have to navigate through stores and then configuration on the configuration page under the web cool block you have to go to the bundle products configuration and here we have two different settings one is the general settings for the bundle product and then we have the front end settings for the bundle products under the general settings for the bundle product here you will be able to enable the bundle product discount option by choosing a yes otherwise to disable it uh, disable this particular functionality for your store you have to choose it as a no then we have the base product type for the bundle so you can choose the base product uh, as a simple one or a configurable one or both of them as per your own requirement then you can choose the child product type for the bundle product it can be of the simple type or of the configurable type so after these settings in the general settings for the bundle product then we have the front end settings then we have the enable of front end so this would enable the uh, basically the bundle products link in the header there if you enable this particular option as a yes then we have enable bundle promotion on cart as i've already shown you within the cart as well when we go to the view and edit cart for example here as well we are able to see the extra special bonus or the, the extra special bundle price products with the bundle thing there so within the cart as well so that uh, can that can be enabled uh, from this particular section by choosing a yes then we have the bundle product display you can display the uh, or the bundle product display can be displayed as child products with base products or only child products right now what we have done is that we have set it as uh, the child product with the base products as well so here we have the uh, base product as well as the child products now for example if i choose it as only child products and i save this configuration here then the uh, base products would be removed and only the child products would be left here so right now let me refresh this particular page here so now you can see that the uh, base products have been removed and the child products have only been shown up there as you can see right now on the bundle product section under the extra special bundle price uh, section there uh, then uh, we have the display all bundles in separate layout so if you choose it as a yes then it would be visible under the bundle products uh, link all of the bundle products would be visible under the bundle products link there then we have the bundle product display in pagination so right now we have set it to 2 if i set it to 1 and i save the configuration right now we cannot see any uh, pagination here but after saving the configuration here if i refresh uh, this particular page you can see we have a pagination here so we have said that only one bundle product should be visible on one page so that's why now it's showing items one of one 
of two total so for the second we have to tap on the number two thing and uh, we'll be taken to the second page of the extra special bundle price section that with the particular bundle products so let me make it as two once again and let me save the configuration there and uh, after the configuration has been saved let's refresh the page now both of the products are visible here both of the bundle products are visible here without the uh, base products because we have set only the child products as enabled here uh, bundle product display is only child products so only the child products are visible there so yes that was much about the uh, magento 2 product bundle discount uh, plugin and i hope it helped you out in understanding the workflow the same if you still have any questions queries suggestions or requirements regarding the same then you can anytime get back to us at support at the rate of webcool.com or you can raise a ticket at webcool.uvds.com as well. Apart from that, if you find this particular video helpful, then do kindly give it a thumbs up. And lastly, thanks for watching this particular video and have a great day ahead.